My name is John Harderson. I'm a physician assistant at Iowa Weight Loss Specialist. So a lot of things change following surgery in terms of medical conditions. Obstructive sleep apnea is a common one that can definitely improve with weight loss no matter how it's done. And it really has to do with neck size. We know that neck size is a big factor with diagnosing somebody with sleep apnea. And that's why a lot of times in sleep clinics, they actually measure the circumference of the neck. Now, following weight loss surgery or weight loss in any way, we don't really know where the weight is going to be lost, where the distribution is going to be. But if a patient's neck size can go down, we know that should improve not only sleep apnea, but also improve snoring. So we do have the ability to test sleep apnea at our clinic. And there have been cases where we will test somebody before surgery, find out what level of sleep apnea they have and possibly treat it if it's there. And then we will repeat that six months following surgery once significant weight is lost and there's often drastic improvements.